Hello again. Today I wanted to do something a little bit different. I have a project that I want to accomplish with our front entryway closet, so I figured I would film it and take you along with me. So let's get to it. All right, so this is our entryway. We have these double doors leading into the living room and we keep them closed to keep the cat contained. Um, this is the front door to our house. And then we have a little window, a bench, a rug, and an end table where I drop off things like my um, bag after work and my sunglasses. And here is the closet in question. So this closet, one, it just needs a good cleaning. Um, I can't remember the last time we actually gave it a good cleaning, but it also has some things in here that probably need to be cleared out. This is where I store my winter boots. This is all of my outerwear. I've got my bike lock, a couple of hats, um, a camelback backpack, and the backpack that I travel with. This is all of my husband's outerwear. And then on the floor in this corner, we used to have a an old computer that um, we donated. So I want to put our suitcases that are currently in the guest bedroom there. Um, most of these are my husband's shoes. A lot of them are really old and in not great condition and should probably be replaced. And then over here we have a couple of boxes. I'm not really sure what's in those. Those are my Sorel boots um, and some mystery shoes of my husband's it looks like. But I want to take everything out and give it a good cleaning and I have an idea for what I want to do with the hats, but we'll see what happens. I gave everything a good cleaning, so now this big top shelf is clear and clean, and then the bottom of the closet had the first cleaning it's had possibly in its life or since we bought the house, and so now it's time to put stuff back into the closet. Okay, so I, what I want to do now is put some things back in the closet, but the projecty part of this endeavor is that I want to hang those two hats that you saw up there on the wall. So I went to Home Depot and I bought a couple of hooks um, and I want to hang these guys up on the wall. I don't wear them that often but I think it'll look really nice whenever you open up the closet. And so I did some quick math to figure out where I should put those hooks. So now I get to go get a drill. These are the hooks that I ended up getting. They had more attractive hooks, but I think these will actually grab, they will extend into the hat the most um, and be the most stable, so I went with those. Okay, I had my husband put these in because I am too short to do it without a ladder. So now these hooks are in and I get to clean up all this dust. The closet is done. So I'll show you what it looks like now. I'll give you an overview. And I'll start at the bottom. So I moved our suitcases from the guest uh, bedroom closet into here. We want to make the guest bedroom less of sort of the junk drawer of the house and so I moved them into these corners. I did have them all on one side but it looked a little bit um, cramped and so I put one on each side. I have them sitting on top of these pieces of paper because the casters on the suitcases will stick to the concrete floors um, so that keeps them from adhering to my floors. And then here, these are all of my husband's shoes, or these aren't all of them, he has a couple of other pairs, but these are his, they're not mine. And then up here, we have all of my husband's outerwear and all of mine. And then up on the top shelf, we have two backpacks, the backpack that I use for travel, whenever I don't use my suitcases, which is most of the time, and a camelback backpack, or I don't think it's camelback, but it's a similar concept. And then over here, we have my two pairs of tall winter boots, 
my sorrels and my husband's winter hiking boots as well. Again, keeping those off the ground so the rubber doesn't stick to the, stick to the concrete. And then up at the top are the two hats that we hung. And uh, there's nothing up here on the shelf anymore. I put into our little storage shed that holds our bikes a bunch of bike parts that I found up there. So we're getting rid of, or those bike parts now live where they are meant to live. And then all of this stuff um, is going to be gotten rid of. There's a pair of shoes here that my husband's going to donate. A couple of these need to be recycled. And I think he's going to sell or donate um, the routers. But that's it. Oh, and somebody's found a closet. She's usually not allowed in here. But I hope you've enjoyed seeing this tiny transformation. We didn't do a whole lot to it, but I'm very pleased. I think this was a Sunday evening well spent. As always, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Hello. Wanna say bye? She says bye.